Tales of Iron is a side-scroller action RPG. Souls-like. It is not a roguelike or anything like that. It is a Souls-like adventure platformer, uh, and it is very addicting. Um, it is just difficult enough to make you want to throw your controller, but not so difficult that you feel like you can't overcome the challenge, right? Uh, which is which is typical of a good Souls-like balance, right? Not necessarily just punishing just for the sake of being punishing, but punishing to show you uh, and help teach you and guide you in terms in terms of being a, uh, towards being a better, um, uh, just basically having better timing and making fewer mistakes. Um, there's not a lot of room for that in a Souls-like. <laughs> you make a mistake and sometimes it's a one shot and that's it. Then you have to go back through, you know, reload and then go back through an entire scene, all this stuff. Oh God. Um, and so that's, that's, that's happened a couple times to me on some boss fights in this game. Uh, but overall, beautiful game and um, definitely one of the one of the, uh, the, the, the better quality Souls-like platformers that I've seen in a long time. Uh, Salt and Sanctuary is another one that I felt like was pretty good um, for what I had played of it. Um, and this one is, is right up there, if not maybe even better. Uh, visuals are fantastic. Uh, the combat feels really, really good. Um, the story is evolving. Like, just, there's, there's definitely a story here that seems very interesting. Their kingdom's been taken over by frogs. You are rats, right? It's basically the, uh, it's the war of the rodents, essentially. Uh, but the best part is, is that it's voiced by, uh, narrated by Doug Cookie, or Cockle, sorry. Um, Doug Cockle is the voice of, um... Of, 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 of Geralt in the Witcher series. Uh, the video game series, not the, not the TV series, not, not Henry Cavill. <laughs> It'd be weird, right? Um, anyways, yeah, so he is the, is the voice of this. So as we're playing, you may hear a voiceover come on every once in a while, um, uh, and narrate a, a scene or whatever, but, uh, that's all part of, that's all part of the, um, uh, of the charm of the game, right? All right, let me go ahead and stop here. This is the next step in my in my uh, in my questing here. Uh, this is still very early in the game. Uh, it's just you know punishing, right? <laughs> so it, it's taken a long time to get to this point, but it's really not that far in. Everybody talks like this. It's very don't starve esque, right? Little tweets, little toots. His brother's chef was glad to be home. Here we go. But the smith was still missing. The chef believed he might have also been captured. Maybe the Elder knew where. Maybe. Hmm. So the game's pretty good at kind of plotting out where you need to go next, right? You just hit this up and it says, okay, rat, rat king guy go this way. That's me. I'm the king, right? Or I'm trying to basically get my crown back here. Uh, upper left corner, you can see how many arrows I have. You can see that I'm using melee. You can see that uh, I have uh, some some healing juice left, which, by the way, I need to go and fill that up. Uh, your combat your combat and maneuvers, your, your, um, your moves are all pretty basic. You have a roll, a dodge. Uh, it also kind of acts as kind of a quick little sprint, little slide, but basically it's the same thing either way. Let me see. Where is the... Oh, hold on a second. Is there not a... Uh... Oh, there's no no place to fill up in here. Okay, well, we're just going to keep on going. Keep on going. So you could fill up your um, your little your little healing juice there, that uh, little thing of honey or whatever that is. Uh, you could fill that up pretty much wherever uh, wherever there's a uh, where there's a station for it. And you can max it out and then fill your, up your health and everything. So once you find one of those things, you're basically at max, max health and you have your um, maximum... Uh, what's it called? Uh, 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 refills as well. So it's the forgiving in that regard. It would soon be as if the frogs had never come. There we go. Like I said, I just completed the, what I believe is probably the prologue. All right, so he's saying the kingdom. Um, the captain, oh, here we go. Had recovered, had spread word of the king's rescue of the elders. Ah, there we go. To show their gratitude, the villagers would help rebuild the rat fort. Cool. And then let's see. There are side missions here, so let's go ahead and take a look at this board. Maybe we'll prioritize a side mission. Uh, let me see. Oh, we already did this one, it looks like. Okay. <laughs> Is that what that means? Does that mean I already have it? Let me see. Uh, save the smith. Let's go and switch to this. Here we go. Oh, here we go. So, uh, the farmers are complaining that the village elder that the farmhouse uh, basement has a grub problem. Clear it out. All right, let's do it. Where is that at? Is it back? Oh, it's down here. Okay. Let's zoom out a little bit. Okay, let's go over there and do that. I know I have to go in here and whatever, but I want to progress the story. You guys could do that yourselves. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and venture through. through. Uh, there's probably some mobs. I know there's some mobs over here we could fight. Uh, and we could just do it the slow way instead of uh, fast travel. Give you guys a look at the surroundings or the environment. Uh, is he going to tell me something? No, okay, we're good. He's probably just going to be like, you're so awesome. And I'm like, I know. <laughs> uh, P.S. I'm wearing a, a pumpkin as a helmet. Uh, it's it's a skin. 
Uh, probably came with the, uh, I guess it was a DLC or something that came out recently. Um, the game was released September 17th, 2021. Uh, the price is $24.99. Seems you know, five, a little $5 over like what normally would, would we, we would consider to be like an indie game range, mid-range. Uh, but the quality, it, it, the quality is there. So um, there should be nothing in here, but it gives us an opportunity to take a look at our uh, our stores here, what we have. So um, so check this out. So here's the helmet here. Uh, you have light, medium, heavy. I think this one's a heavy. No, it's not. It's a, it's a little light, medium. No, it's not. Okay, so it's a light. <laughs> and then you can toggle the variant skin. So this is what it's supposed to look like, and the variant skin gave us this, which is pretty cool. We could use that one. Uh, you can see on the left-hand side, defense goes down, weight goes up, defense goes down, weight goes down. If we go back over here to the heavy, uh, you can see that weight goes way up, and defense only goes up a little bit. There's frog resistance, mosey resistance, mole resistance, grub resistance. It's going to be you versus basically all the other rodents and nuisances that you find in a typical garden or, uh, you know, old like homestead or something. Um, shield. I believe this is a medium shield that I just picked up recently. Yeah, I did. Uh, so medium shields. If I go back to the light shield, you'll see that, you know, there's they're much lighter. Also, this one has a variant skin. Ba -ding, ba -ding, ba -ding. Isn't that cute? Um, so I can remove a bunch of stuff. Uh, or at least, at least, at least bring it down from. I think it's a medium as well. Yeah, I could take it out from medium to light, and that would probably change the way that my character would, uh, um, you know, handle himself, maneuver, or stamina, or rolling, and all that good stuff. Uh, I did just pick up the spear, but um, see, one hand. Oh, it's it's better, technically better than this in every way. But this looks so cool, though. All right, so this spear came off of a boss, which is pretty rad. Uh, what is this? I thought I picked this up. Oh, just three arrows. Okay, cool. Let's not jump down because there's definitely a height issue with uh, jumping down off things <laughs> you don't want to just throw yourself off of a ledge because you will take damage all right let's go let's actually just go to save right here saving is super quick sit down does a save roll on out perfect right no bs no save to this slot none of that stuff none of that stuff okay hold on a sec. where am i going we have to go in here and go down let's do it going to the cellar fight some grubs oh here's the dude okay cool What's up, man? The farmer had fled his grub-infested basement in terror. He was sure they would destroy his bug-juicing machine before long. Mm. Reggie assured the farmer he would not let that happen. That's right, Reggie. My boy, Reggie. Let's go. I've actually already been down here. There was some loot down here before. All right, so this is where we get ready. There we go. Controls are pretty basic. I mean, everything's there that you need. Left click, or left click, uh, left uh, trigger. Two. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Whoa, 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 Left trigger to hold up your shield. It's gonna point whichever direction your right thumbstick points. We're gonna try to avoid some dudes here so I can talk about combat a little bit before I actually start engaging in combat. There we go. Oh, that was a missed block. So the red circle above the head means that there's gonna be an area attack. So you just basically gotta avoid where the area is gonna be. He's either gonna stop on the ground. Oh, shit. He's either gonna stop on the ground or he's going to, uh, uh or do that. Like basically come from uh, underneath. So let's do this real quick. He's gonna jump. There we go. And we can slap him around that way. Whoa! We have, we have a ranged weapon ability, uh, which is going to be our bow. Cap him a couple times. Let him come out. Stab him a little bit. He's probably going to do an attack here in a minute. Their tails are pretty... Not fairly obvious, but obvious enough. Uh, you get used to them. There you go. While you have your shield up, you can do a nice little slap. Get out of the way. Yo, get, oh, get out of the way! Whoa! This guy's also going to come out. Probably underneath me. Nope, this guy's underneath me. Oh, boy. <laughs> Slap. Oh, I saw the wrong one. Where's he coming? Whoa! This guy's about done. These guys don't really seem to have any other attacks, so... This is going swimmingly. Probably better off when they have, um, another enemy to kind of, to assist them. Usually the enemies come in, uh, in combinations. You have, like, a ranged enemy and a melee weapon, a melee, uh, enemy. You have a shield bearer and then a... A swordsman or something. Let me see. Don't jump. There we go. No double jump. Nothing like that. You can't even jump that high. <laughs> you can't even jump that high. So don't don't get used to that as like a means of uh, of attack or combat or anything. You're rolling on the ground and popping up your shield and doing all that work. Here we go. So we did it. I'm covered in bug juice juice now. All right. Thumbs up. Ooh ooh. Oh, it gave me grub resistance. And the, the weight goes up, the defense goes up as well. Let's do it. Oh, we get a spear as well. Ooh, one-handed. So it's heavier, but it doesn't really help me much more. So the grubs were let's gone. Store that one. The farmer could now make the best freshly squeezed bug juice in all wrapped up. All right. Reggie liked it with bits. <laughs> Reggie liked it with bits. All right, yeah, it's a frog. Okay, frog up there. I can't get up there, though, man. 
But can I? Oh, they opened us up. No, I need a key. Yep. Sorry, guy. I need a key. Can't help you. Can't help you. Alright, so a little bit of lowly combat there. Let's find some frogs to beat up. Surely there are some. We might have to progress the story just a little bit in order to make that happen. Mm-hmm. Full juice. Full health. Let's move. I love the parallax effect. Um, well, it's not really parallax, I guess. This is like multiple layers here that are moving. Um, like, what? Oh, shit. I wasn't paying attention. I didn't know you could fall down there and not die. <laughs> oh, wait, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Arrows. Automatically aim. All right. <laughs> Just so you know. They automatically aim, but it doesn't necessarily mean that they will hit your, their target every time. Oh, there's something right next to this thing, actually. Probably some arrows or something. Yep. Three arrows. Arrows are everywhere, but it doesn't necessarily mean you can use spam them. Doesn't always work that way. Longtail village. Again with the layering. There's always like dudes walking around the background working or enemies marching around back there. It's very cool. Okay, so now let's go talk. Let's go talk to this guy. He's sleeping half the time when I come up here. And even now. Wake up. We gotta find the the, the blacksmith. So he can forge me new weapons. <laughs> Squeak, squeak, squeak. Oh, the blacksmith? They took him away, them frogs. But I sent a dude with arrows. And he went that way. Okay, take this key, right? Not so lucky this time. Yep, got a key. The elder hadn't seen the frogs with the smith. But maybe the ever vigilant rangers had seen where the frogs had gone. There we go. That was the ranger that we had seen then. Young mm. Robin had been headed to the ranger's lodge. Mm -hmm. Maybe Reggie could ask there. The ranger's lodge? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's where I was going. Oh, the guard is missing here. Okay, so that guard probably had something other than say than uh, you're awesome. He probably was like, hey, man, you got to go talk to this guy. Oh, 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 oh. Something's happening. See, I love it. Oh, bugs. Okay, I got my bug suit on. Oh, bugs in the windmill. Rotting corpses always bring pests. If the grubs get beyond the farm, they'd be everywhere soon. Can't shoot that far up, I guess. Yeah, see? <laughs> just <laughs> You don't always hit your target. I was hoping that it would drop somewhere more convenient, but it's not worth it for me to drop down there. Okay, let's go ahead and hit this guy. Wait, what? What is that? Eggs? Oh, yeah, no, no, we got smash. Okay, damage. Okay, good, good, good. This is not going to last forever. 14 more. Whoa. Stab him a couple times with it down. Oh, oh, damn. A couple stabs in nice. Ooh. Okay, that, that shock effect that he just had over his over his body before he charged, that means you can push back on it with this and then right trigger to smack him and do a good amount of damage. Oh, I just blocked him like that, but then I beat the shit out of him. <laughs> so stay still, son of a bitch. I have my bug armor on. I wonder how much damage Ooh, it would do otherwise. See, like that right there. Bam! Look at that catch. Look at that catch. It's intensely satisfying you do it against melee. And then we give it a stabby stab, and you're done. There it is. Love the kills, too. A little quick little kill stabby animation. Oh, cool. Got a bunch of Titan or something. It's all resources that I'm probably going to use later on. Let me see. Uh, go through my stuff. Let me see arrows. Uh, upper right corner there, what's it say? Uh, can I move my mouse? Let me see, will it tell me? Nope. Okay, I'm gonna assume it's like chitin or something, because I only get it from bugs. Probably used to, um, to once I get the blacksmith to later buff my, uh, my armor or some, something like that. Alright, let's go ahead and charge up. P.S. You can do this while walking, so if you're in a fight and things are getting pretty heated, you don't necessarily have to stand still to heal yourself. Which is very handy, because a lot of times I spend a lot of time walking around super slow trying to get, like, little tiny bits of health so I don't fucking die. Uh-oh. Okay, lots of baddies here. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I know. There's, there's the, same, the same ones before. Stab him. Quick. There we go. Ooh, that was close. He's down, he's down, he's down, he's down. Do you step thing. Whoa! Duh. So, whenever they do the AoE attack, even with the shield up, you cannot dodge. Good catch. Good catch. Good catch. Stab, 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 stab. There he is right there. He needs to come down. Finish him right here, maybe? There it is. Oh! Snuck up on me. Just heal, 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 walk, heal, walk, heal, walk, dodge. Okay, 
he's gonna come up underneath. Let's take care of this guy first if we can. Oh man, he's gonna do this. Oh dang! Oh man. Okay, that's if let's if for juice. I have very little left. Let's take this guy, get him out of the picture here if we can. Oh, right next to me. Nope, 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 nope. That's what I'm talking about. Dang! Every fight feels good. I mean, as it's 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 typical of a, of a Souls like, or it should be, where it's like every encounter feels like, wow, man, I barely survived that. Or I was one mistake away from having to roll all the way back. <laughs> Collect monster parts. Hey, we got 50 monster parts. I guess they're just monster parts then. Let's go find a safe somewhere, please. Hold on. I'm sure there's a save right near the side of this. We have a key now. Let's go. The sewers. His royal ancestors had lifted rats from such places. No rat had dwelt here for years. Hmm. Oh, there you go. Oh, we got some. What are these hostile? Oh, arrows. Okay. We'll take the arrows instead of smashing the, the bin. Do I have to smash the bin to take the arrows? <laughs> okay, hold on. Max. Okay, let's not break it. Unless that other one was meant to be broken. Okay, sorry, guy. <laughs> yeah, we could we could swap out some armor and stuff here. Probably a good opportunity to change the bugs if we didn't already have bug stuff. But, let's see. Do I have anything that's better against bugs? That's better against rats. Right, yeah. Or it's better, no, that's better, oh, that's what I'm using, duh. Um, yeah, nothing, nothing that really raises my one hand. So it looks like I'm, uh, this is what I'm wearing. Do I have any light, medium, or heavy armor that supports any kind of resistance towards these baddies? No. Add weight for just a tiny little bit of, of uh, resistance. No, thank you. Just check in. I don't think I have any other, no, I don't. Okay. Yeah, there's no heavies. All right. All right, Reggie. Let's go and heal up save and let's see if we can't smash this thing okay cool now we know <laughs> now we know <laughs> i wasn't sure crawl into the next area bugs ah. well whatever if he's gonna stay back there let's keep going <laughs> Mm-hmm. I already got half your health at least, maybe more. Yep. Take this guy out too. Yeah, some frogs in the background there. There you go. There's no way I wanna just fight bugs during this series here. I'm not going up there. What the hell? There's like no walkway. Unless there's a this there's a Oh, it's telling me. Okay. Just tell me I need something, another weapon, or there's a fish bone. Is the fish bone like a grapple hook or something that we'll eventually get? Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Am I supposed to do from here? Oh, this is dangerous. Oh, I sure can. Look at us, look at us. I'm sure this is probably the way we were supposed to go. Oh, wait a minute, there's, there's another way to go up. But it is, there are Metroidvania elements here, right? That should be noted. Well, I wouldn't call it a Metroidvania necessarily. Like the map layout, or you're you're going back and repeating areas, or you're deviating off and still complete, still progressing the story somehow, even though you're not on the main path. Like it does feel like there's some of that here. Oh wow, just out of range, huh? Whatever, dude. <laughs> Whatever, man. I don't see. I don't even know if I'm going the right way, but I mean, I might be. Whoa! Oh Jesus. Okay, I didn't know I could do that. Okay, bones. Oh, yeah. When's the last time I saved? Shit. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay, here you go. Oh, oh, ouch. Okay. Yep. Hold on. All right, this is going to be a fight. Okay. What's this? AoE attack. Okay, good. He just burrows. We could block that. We could block that. You gonna dive? Yes, he is. Cool. Predictable. 
Oh, damage coming out. Whoa, whoa. Oh, God. More damage. Oh, even with my fucking parry. <laughs> All right. Well. Well. Um. Hello, fellas. Let's try a different route. <laughs> Let's try a different way up. Well, I'm going to beat you up just, just for doing that nonsense. Slap. Get down. Start that mask out of here. I'm a busy man. I'm a busy rat. Got things to do. I'm <laughs> bugs down. Oh my god. There's two of them. <laughs> How did it get worse? Okay. Oh, damn. Bad timing. Oh, I'm gonna be a bitch. There was two of them, man. What am I supposed to do? There's two of them. <laughs> There's two of them. Oh no. Oh no. Is it gonna be like that? It's gonna be like that. Okay, cool. Very slippery, but we made it anyways. Okay, new thing, new mechanic. And then slide all through. Whoa. Oh! <laughs> Dang! And this is the part. This is the part where I'm like, where, where I mentioned earlier in Discord, I was like, this game keeps on bringing me back. Like I just keep on playing, and I just keep on coming back to it. Because there's little things like that where it's like, all right, cool. Let me try another way. Let me try another way. Let me try another way. And I keep on going and exploring those other routes. And but not necessarily making discoveries that are worse than my previous encounters. Whoops. Okay. Well, you can see it took some damage there. Just gonna try this again. Then hop. Then we'll hop up. There we go. Okay, I'm excited to make that again. Down, and then we go across. We'll keep on going up this time. Surely there's nothing worse up here. Three of them, maybe? The ranger needed help. Oh, oh shit. Here we go. Okay, I forgot. You can't block those. with like smash them or something, or dodge them. Okay, there's the rangers, my buddy. Yeah, I can't block those. Come on, man. There we go. Okay, let's get the rhythm going. Watch out for that. Yep. Okay. So that guy was really easy to dispatch. Let me see. Is there somebody else? I feel like there's more enemies coming, maybe? Maybe not. We have to keep on venturing forward with our buddy here. Yeah. Okay, what's this guy's moves? Oh. Mm-hmm. Whoa, man. Just out of range for that. Out of range for that. These guys are all doing strong attacks. There's no, like, light attacks, so there's no blocking. The, the red lines basically means that that's a free hit. And let me know if you stand out of the way, that is. Anything good? Probably arrows or something. Yeah. Oh, chitin. Sure. All monster parts now, because yeah, they're not just coming from bugs. Okay, hold on a second. This looks like there might be something underneath here. There is indeed. Oh, right over his head. Stay still. Okay, let's pick up his bug parts or whatever. What is this? Ooh, ooh, a big, big defense boost. Nice. Um, characters move much slower now, it feels like. Uh, <laughs> can I hop? Uh, let's try swap everything out for... Oh, wait. Can't do it right here. That's right. Can't do it right here. I was saying let's try to swap all for uh, for light armor, but yeah, I can't do it. Unless I'm at a chest. I'm curious. What, what is gameplay like when you're, when you're very nimble? Oh! Hold on. What's this then? Okay, what am I forgetting here? Let me see. Oh, hmm. Oh, that's the way to go out from over there. Okay, so I need to I need to finish. You know what? They're gonna want me to finish these bosses. Um, let me see. Go up, over, into the building there. Let's zoom out. Let me see. Yeah, 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 yeah. We can make it there. Let's go. Oh, oh it's too late. Oh, ouch. Yep. Again. These guys, nothing but heavy attacks, boy. Nothing but heavy attacks. This is the house. Got it. Okay. Ooh. That seems rad. P 
P.S. You also have two-handed weapons on this. I just haven't gotten any yet. We need a key. Gotcha. What do we got here? Key? Nope. Monster. Oh, I remember. I guess he had a key. <laughs> I wasn't really paying attention to those bubbles, I guess. All right, let's go, man. Hmm. All right, yep, that guy. Mm, where is he? That guy? Well, they took him away, just like the other guy said. But he went to a tower, though, not to this house. Oh, and he has a big axe. Oh, there's a big axe upstairs. Ooh, a two-headed axe! I bet that's what that is. The head ranger saw the smith taken to the tower by the foul Swamp Slayer clan. Ooh, look at that. But the frogs had barricaded the path. Two-handed. Only a heavy two-handed axe would shatter it. Got it. That's not it. But yeah, we can swap like this. Hell yeah. Oh, we can refill. Yeah, and it says, yeah, swap back and forth. Very handy. Top off. <laughs> I gotta get our last bit. Yeah, man, we got it. That's just, yep, yep, there we go. Good. Oh, he's blocking me until I do it. That's fine. I understand. I understand you need to do that. Otherwise, someone's going to put a complaint on the forums or something. <laughs> oh, side missions out here. Oh, okay. <laughs> I didn't know they were. I thought they were. I guess. All right. Uh, we smash. Not that one. Smash. Oh, right trigger. Right trigger. Heavy attack. Huh? Keep on smash. 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 Hold it down. Nothing like the there feel of an axe smashing through tough wood. Reggie wondered if it would do the same to frog shields. Yeah, huh? And I frog do. skulls. Yeah, yeah. Let's keep on. What's this? What's you guys got here? Hmm. Okay, he's got it. Yeah, we're gonna store that. Like my two hand. Oh, there's bad guys over there. He didn't see me though. <laughs> Somehow. All right, do I have shield up? I do. Okay, hold on a second. What if I could charge in there and just skull smash? That you could block. Wait, hold on a Did I switch automatically when I... Okay, just my two hand. Oh, I can't. Okay, I can block my two hander. Oh, damn it. Oh. God, his refresh on that ability is really fast. Big, big, big attack. Oh, yeah, big chopping. Oh, nice. Shield bros. These are the ones I want to test the big the big axe out on. Oh, uh, wait. Hold on a second. It's hard to tell because I have two axes, so. <laughs> like, which? That's not it. Hold on. Am I still freaking? Hold on. Pull it out. There we go. Okay. Oh, it seems to be, I mean, it seems to be like, oh, whoops. Uh, I should just maintain the, um, like, keep that for a rainy day, basically. Yeah, although, I, I'm still, whoa, dang it. Oh, I blocked, no, I did not. I blocked my face. Okay, this is probably where the, the two-hander is going to come in handy. This guy's got a big-ass shield. And he's probably not going to let me behind him. Yeah, it's going to be difficult like that. Let him do an attack. Let him do an attack. Get distance. Oh, there it is. Oh, I took that? Oh, man. Come on, do it again. Give it to me again. Come on. Oh, dang it. I tried to roll. Oh, man. This guy's tough. Tough, and he's hardly doing anything. Oh my god, oh, Jesus. Oh, man! <sighs> Come on, give me an attack, give me an attack, give me something, give me something, give me something, give me something. I wonder if I can block his, uh, his charge attack. Nope, not that one. That one. Nice! Oh! 
The ranger was excited Damn. to help the king. An unforgettable tale to tell Ooh. his children one day. <laughs> well, great. Now he's going to die. <laughs> That's what happens. All right, let's get all these arrows back. Of course, it's not maxed out. It's like 20. And my health is not doing too hot. Hammer. He would never have dropped it willingly. Uh-oh. We must save the smith. Let's go. We're not going to pick up his hammer? Poor guy. I have all this. I have like 15 weapons on me. I can't like pick up the hammer for my buddy. Oh, gosh. I try to pull out my shield real quick. But I'm too busy having fun with this morning start. Hold on a second. Do I have two? Two? There we go. Okay. This guy has a melee. It's, never mind. Help. He needed to get to his brother as fast as possible. Ooh. Would he find him still alive better, in the tower? Better range. God, I'm like really hurt for health. Fuck me. That's a fight this guy with no health. Oh my god. Blocka, blocka. Oh no. Okay, attack. I cannot dodge. Or cannot. No. Oh. oh gosh, another one. Okay. Does he have a, does he have a strong shield? Let's see. I got a hit off of him. Hold on a second. What is going to do? Hell of damage. I got, I got ten more. Okay, well, let's not waste them. Oh, nope. Oh! <laughs> God damn, man. Hey, you know what, man? I think that's enough. I think you've seen enough. <laughs> I think you've seen enough. Uh. <laughs> So here's a medals on. I don't want to show you guys too much here uh, in memory of oh <laughs> rats. Um, uh, just go to the settings real quick. You can see there's basically settings. Change your settings if you want to. All your controls and everything. I know it's important. Uh, camera shake. I reduced the camera shake. It was really heavy initially, and I, yeah, it was like making me sick. <laughs> but uh, I see all unsaved progress will be lost. We just saved, so we're good. Um, but yeah, I mean, the game is called Tales of Iron. Iron. Uh, uh, it recently got a Bloody Whiskers, a, a, what's called Bloody Whiskers uh, 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 update. They have a number of like skins and variants and all that stuff. No like shop or anything like that. It's all like in-game shit. Single player, uh, very, very, very challenging. Um, very challenging, <laughs> but also very rewarding. A really good balance, a really, really good balance. Um, but uh, you can pick it up right now on Steam. $424.99 has very very good reviews over there so you can check that out my name is mike b aka phony the game is called tales of iron have a good one